focused on the road. Whoa. No oh, God! Oh God, something is on the roof. Bro? Can you go check that out? Did he just bust my windshield? I can feel the weight of something in my car. Ah! Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome to a game called Drive Me to Hell. Now you are driving home late at night and this game is called what it is because something scary is about to happen. We are about to figure out what it is right now. If you guys cool with that, down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, cause here we go. Warning, this game contains violent images and flashing lights. I feel like I have like a fat booger stuck in the wall of my nose right here. So we have woken up in an empty diner. I'm assuming it's late at night and we just inhaled whatever we ordered because there was nothing but nut dust on that plate. It's getting late. I'd better head home before it gets too dark. It's not that dark, so good. I was gonna say something about it's already dark as shit. But hello, everybody. How's everyone doing today? Everyone doing fantabulous? All right. Okay, I guess they're not really the talking type. What about back here? Nothing back there. But just this random family that all seems to be turning away at me. Do I offend? Is it because I'm hideous? I must be a hideous beast. Uh, later, everybody. Have a great night. Let's get the show on the road. That's a dirty car. It looks like it stinks. It smells like cigarettes and cat piss, most likely. But let's go home. WASD to drive. All right. Hopefully this is the way home. Can I put on my GPS? Driver's manual. Okay, this is the wrong way. Mother All right. There we go. This is the right way. Why does the floor of my car look like that? This dude's a slob. He's a hog. What do they call him? Slobs, right? Yeah, he's a slob. Press F to toggle the headlights. Oh, wow, okay. I know how to honk, too. That's annoying as shit. And I can look back because somebody's probably gonna be in my back seat. Holy shit. God damn, I'm reckless. What was in that coffee? What is that? I guess I'll go this way. I mean, that's the only commentary you're gonna get, everybody. Whoa, fucking deer. <laughs> that deer looked like it needs some milk or something. It was a little skinny in the legs. I need to blow my nose. I have like a booger in my nose, and I think I need to blow it out real quick. Give me one second. I've never taken this way home before. I don't give a double doggy style damn. I think I saw something in the back. Okay, never mind. That was just the rear view mirror. I'm freaking myself out. I still got that booger in my nose, by the way. I'm not playing about that. You know when you just have, like, a sharp booger in the back right here? Like, right where the nose hole meets your brain? It's it's doing its thing right now. My booger is boogering right now. But I'll blow it in a second. Once I get some downtime, once I get over this Golden Gate Bridge, I guess I live in San Francisco or something. Because, golly, hopefully this is a one-way bridge. Because I'm driving right here in the middle. I don't give a shit. Damn, that bitch is stuck. <laughs> oh, you son of a mother bitch. Back to driving in the streets of Alabraska or wherever I am. I'm driving through the city now. Late at night. You already know it's going to get freaky zeeky. Let me be an asshole. Let me start uh, disrupting the peace or whatever. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of the streets of Night Ripper. That one puppet combo game. With that dude, what is that? Was that always there? Whoa. Uh. Oh, fuck me! Whoa! Who was that? Whose ugly ass face was that? Oh, that was kind of creepy. Okay, now some weird stuff's starting to happen. Ever since I blew my nose. What's going on? I need to find a way home quickly. I'm trying, man. I'm pushing 80. My levels are elderly home. I'm pushing 90 right now. I feel like I'm in a bad area or something. Parking what? What does that say? Uh -oh. Where the fuck am I? I don't like this. This is giving me the creeps already. God damn. Why am I going up here? What is the point of- ah! <laughs> Scary as! Oh crap. Okay. I thought somebody was gonna be in my back seat. Alright. What am I doing here? What was that? 
Can I get out the car? What am I doing here just to suffer? Oh. Oh, fuck me! What the heck? Hi. Where am I? Holy crap. What is this game, dude? What is happening? Bro, it's so hard for me to drive because I'm freaked out. Is this where I go? I don't understand. I am horrible at this game. I did not say that I'm a driving master, everybody. But that jump scare actually hurt me. It wasn't even a jump scare. It was just a scare. Freaked me the fuck out. All right. Everybody's parked here nice and neatly. Never seen that before. Oh, man. I can tell the jump scares in this game are going to be wild. More wild than my reckless driving. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's another car. Move out the way, bitch. Okay, let's keep going. <gasps> <laughs> I am sweating under my pepperoni nipples right now. This is not good. This game is freaky so far, I will say. Now we're back in the... Who just opened my car door? Who wants these problems? I have a gun in my glove compartment. I don't. I really don't. I wish I did, though. I have these hands. I know karate. I watch movies. <laughs> Whoa! Jesus Christ! Not quite. Okay. This is me and my beloved family. Damn, they're ugly as fuck. Get that out of my way before we get us all killed. I don't want to see them. We've come to claim your soul. My soul? I don't have no soul. You picked the wrong car. What are you talking about? I sold my soul a long time ago. Why are you looking at me like that? Are you coming home with me tonight? Am I really taking you home? It's like 2 a.m. at the club and I'm taking you home. Hell no. I'm going faster just for that. I'm going 100. Oh! Did this dude just throw up on my dick? What's wrong with this guy? I must be having a bad nightmare. I don't know. This dude's for real, like, passed out of my back seat. It reminds me of when me and my friends freshly turned 21. And we would just be like, knock the fuck out. And we'd have somebody drive us home. <laughs> Dude's just knocked out of my back seat. What kind of tunnel are we in right now? Let me just focus on the road. Whoa. Oh, God. Oh, God. Something is on the roof. Bro. Can you go check that out? Did he just bust my windshield? I think he busted my windshield. It looks cracked out. Oh crap. I can feel the weight of something in my car. Ah! You do what the just coffee, I swear. What are you doing? What the fuck? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna have to start charging for these rides. Cause you two just came in here out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. It is on the road. Move, bitch. I will say I was driving on the wrong side of the road. I was on the left side. But that thing was also on the left side if you flip it in reverse. Wait. Okay, I can't move. So we crashed into the water, and obviously I was hallucinating. Those things weren't real. Was I supposed to do that? Oh! Okay, I can zoom in. Can't see shit. What in the transformer car? What in the rumblebee? What happened? I don't know, but why are you boozing in the car? Where the hell am I? Dude, this dude's boozing! Ew, what the fuck? 
Yo! I know I see worms when I look down there, but this is ridiculous. It is actually pretty freaking hard to drive. And I don't know anything more useless than the honking button on my car. Because it doesn't do anything. I can't honk anymore. That one jump scare when the ghost was in my rear view mirror. And then when I turned around, they were there. That actually hurt something in my back. Like, that ghost really blew my back out because it hurts right now. Where am I? What is happening? I think a gargoyle just stole my door. <laughs> a gargoyle just stole my door. Okay, hopefully I have gargoyle insurance. Oh, shoot. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna drive straight through the fire. Cause I'm like that! I'm like that! Watch me cook! Watch me turn well done! I'm a congratulations, baby! Let's get it! I think I saw the devil. I wanna honk my car. I wanna honk my horn, please. I wanna honk something. Let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. Don't worry about anything else, Jay. This is a detour. You take routes like this all the time. Look at this ball and chain. That's called marriage. You think that's the first time I've seen these swinging balls? Huh. Okay. Great. Oops. I'm a moron. I'm supposed to avoid that, aren't I? Yeah. Okay. All right, everybody. We are in the swinging balls of death. Watch me work this. I didn't know that we could actually die. But now that I know we have something to lose, watch this, everybody. I'm about to be Gran Turismo. Check me out. Check me out. Check me out. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, you thought. It's not really sweet out here. It's not really sweet out here, bitch. Look at that. Okay. What in the world? Where am I? Yeah, keep swinging. Oh, God! Dude, that thing tried to juke me! It was swinging left and made an immediate right. What's up with all these hands? Huh. Is that supposed to be scary? What do you want to do? High five me? You want to slap me on the ass? Too bad. I already slapped my own ass. And I loved it. I moaned when I did it too. I slapped my own ass right before recording. I was like, Hey, Jay, puppy! So joke's on you, you stupid ass hand. It had the whole palm open too. Oh, that thing's behind me. Okay. Dude want to be Godzilla so bad. Bro wants to be a demon so bad. Can't catch me. Come on, come on. I like how my car has behind you detection. That's cute. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Okay, not really. Ew, what the heck is that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Dude, I'm really dodging these. I should be a professional driver. What the heck? Five-star Uber with the shits. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oi! Between the two hands. Oh! How come my horn doesn't work? My lights work, but not my horn? Make it make sense, game? Come on. I can't have one and not the other. Whoa, I didn't know I could zoom like this. Oh, that makes driving so much easier. you all know where to go don't lie to me i know you all didn't know where to go because even i didn't know where to go so i have two options i can either turn where the beast is right or i can go a different direction no i do have to turn where the beast is no i, I don't turn where the beast is i don't turn where the beast is okay there's got to be another way right can i go straight it doesn't look like i can go straight i can go straight it fooled me it made it seem like you had to turn left. Oh, goodness. Come on, man. Why is this shit so slippy and slidey on the wheel? Come on. Oh, he's right behind me. He's on my ass like stink. He's on my stink like butthole ass. Okay, go. What I just said made no sense. But neither does that thing chasing me. So what makes more sense? What doesn't make sense more? Oh, fuck! 
take Jay's in the building. Stop signs? Yeah, right. I'm not stopping. I don't care how many stop signs. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna go even faster when I see a stop sign. Watch me. Watch me not obey the law so hard. Who's gonna pull me over? The devil? <laughs> yes! That's what I get for talking so much. I was so focused on talking shit that I ended up... What is that? There was like some red vein just throbbing. What is that? What? What is... What is that? Bro, I have a random passenger. You're just a freaking red string bean. All right, let's go. Let's go, let's go. No more talking, Jay. Focus on the road. All eyes on the road. Let's get it. Come here. No edit Jay's in the building. I feel like the car just keeps naturally tilting to the left. What is that? It has that Euro curve for no reason. It's on that lean. Okay. We're good. Yeah. Yeah, everybody. Talk to me. <laughs> Talk to me. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. So, yeah, this game is called Drive Me to Hell. I didn't think hell was this far. If you want me to drive to hell, then I'll go to a gym at 5 p.m. That shit's crazy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. All right. Got it. Whoa! Let me stop talking. Because for some reason, talking is getting me in trouble. Talking is making me not want to... Oh! Why did I moan at that? I think it's because it was a close call. All right. Back to where we were. Show me those hands. Let me see those hands. Whoa, whoa. Raise your hand if your mama raised a little bitch. Oh, yeah? Oh, that's funny. I already knew that. Okay. Go, go, go. All right, we dodged that. Dodge that. I get it. What is that? I didn't know what that was. That looked like a Debussy or something. I don't know what that was. That was a car bussy. This game is interesting. Strange interesting. Hello. Yeah, I remember you three. Especially you. You still gotta clean my car. Throwing up on my shit like that. <laughs> Who's that? Who's he? Oh, he. Okay, I know who you're talking about. If I'm dropping down like that, I know who he is. Great. Um, let me make my way over there. Let me make my way downtown. Walking fast paces and fast. That is a full blown car crash. Oh, shoot. My bad. I get it. In a tragic incident, a family of three lost their lives in a car accident. In a tragic incident, a family. Freaking got scared by a goat wearing a bathrobe. So, I was a drunk driver and I killed a family of three. So yeah, I was the bad guy the whole time. Was it the family that was in the diner? Is that why they couldn't look at me? Because after all those scares happened, we saw a bunch of alcohol in the car. 
And yeah, I think that we killed those three people in the diner. That has to have been it because those are the only three people that we saw. So does that mean that we killed them and we also died? So we went to hell and they went to heaven? No, but they were down there in hell too. So what does that even mean? I mean, obviously they were innocent. So they probably just wanted to tell me that I was going to hell while they ascended to heaven. No, they actually didn't go to hell because I dropped down, got my eagle on, twerked my ass for a little bit, and then I got to hell. And then they probably went up to heaven after they told me I did what I did. So that makes sense. So yeah, we were a drunk driver and we killed a family of three and we deservedly went to hell. I mean, the moral of the story all the time is never drink and drive. Even if you feel a little bit buzzed, just call an Uber or wait it out because if you need to hurry home, it's never worth your life, all right, everybody? Like, if you're drinking and thinking about driving and it hasn't even kicked in yet, sometimes it could kick in on the way home. Like, you'll be driving and then all of a sudden, things won't look as just straight as they normally would. And you're driving faster than you actually think you are. So, if you're drinking, never drive, everybody. We have so many apps where people can pick us up. Uber, Lyft, the whole shebang. Call a friend if you're not comfortable with things like that. If you don't have anybody to call, just wait it out. Tell the people where you are, like if you're at a bar or something, or you're at a house party or something, just tell them you're not feeling fit to drive. And I mean, they better not be complete assholes and let you just stay there and sober up. But yeah, everybody, moral of the story, like I said, don't drink and drive. This was Drive Me to Hell. If you all enjoyed me playing it, make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude!